Well, hey there, everyone. My name is Melissa Barnett. Welcome to Dayspring Westland, and thanks for being here. A lot is happening at Dayspring, so we wanted to take a few minutes and share a couple of things coming up for you and your family. So check this out. Your generous giving allows us as a church to do so much. The giving of tithes and offering are always done out of obedience and never obligation. So if you're new to us, don't feel any obligation to give whatsoever. We're just so glad you're here. If you did come prepared to give, there are several different ways you can do that. You can place your gift directly in the box in the back of the sanctuary or give online. If you're new with us today, we're so glad to have you. For us, church is so much more than just a Sunday experience, and we want you to know that there's a place for you at Dayspring. One of the best ways to get connected with us is to fill out the I'm New form online. And that's it. Later this week, someone from our staff will connect with you. Dayspring will celebrate Believer's Baptism on Sunday, August the 28th during the 9.30 and 11 service. Baptism is an opportunity for believers in Jesus Christ to give public testimony and affirmation of their faith. Please sign up at the church information desk or call the church office. Creation with a Purpose will be hosting another event on August the 17th at 6 p.m. In Genesis, we read that mankind was created in the image of God. So if all mankind is made in God's image, does that mean that all mankind is a picture of Christ? We will see what God's word has to say about it and how we can be a picture of Christ to others. Ladies will create an embellished wooden picture frame with a variety of buttons, rhinestones, gems, beads, and even pennies. The frame holds a four by six photo and can be wall mounted or displayed on a table or shelf. Cost is $15. Mark your calendars now for a season of fellowship, food, and entertainment. Dayspring Prime Timers will begin their activities in September. This group welcomes adults age 50 and older on the third Thursday of the month for a planned program, a meal, and a whole lot of fun. Child dedications will be observed on Sunday, August the 21st during the 9.30 and 11 a.m. services. Parents choosing to dedicate their children are encouraged to attend an informational meeting with Pastor Bo. Please submit your child's full name, date of birth, and a picture of your choice to the church office via email or drop it off at the church office Tuesday through Friday, 9 to 3. All information should be submitted no later than Tuesday, August the 17th. We will be hosting a spiritual gift class on Sunday mornings, August 28th and September 4th. The goal of this two-week class is to equip people to love and serve God through the identification and use of their spiritual gifts. This will be accomplished by looking through the lens of scripture, gaining a godly understanding of what a spiritual gift is, who gives the gift, and why the gift is given. Using spiritual gifts well can lead to unity, harmony, and service in the church when based on the love found in the greatest commission and command. Per participants will be shown areas of Dayspring where their gifting can make the most impact. This is a great lead-in class to the upcoming Become class. Guess what? Our golf outing is back, and we have added some new activities, such as a meal after church and putt-putt. If you are interested in this, grab our flyer at the information desk and grab a couple to hand out. We look forward to supporting our youth group through this fun event. Also, if you're interested in sponsoring a hall for $125, there is a flyer for you at the information desk as well. This Sunday night, the youth is throwing another afterglow. This is a party hosted by Nicole and Pastor Bo Hummel. As always, guys bring the pop and girls bring the snacks. Make sure to stay connected with us throughout the week through our app or dayspringwesleyan.org and on Facebook at Dayspring Wesleyan. We believe God has something unique to say to you. And our hope is that you feel his love stronger today than ever before. Thanks again for being with us. Let us prepare our hearts and minds for God's message today through Pastor Chuck.